Hey guys, how's it going? Daniel here. So my name is Daniel and I make a ton of tech videos if you're new to the channel. So you probably just received a new iPhone for your Christmas present and today I want to share with you guys some amazing widgets to have for your iPhone setup. So let's get started. So the first widget we have is called Headlines. Headlines is an amazing widget that was released this year and it's probably one of my favorite widgets of this year. So Headlines of course is a app that uses RSS feed to uh, let you see your favorite blogs that you follow. So if you follow an, uh, so if you follow a lot of blogs and everything, you can now have a widget that allows you to see the latest article of each blog um, in six panels or in one panel depending on what type of size of the widget you want. If you want a small, medium or large widget, of course I'm a fan of the large widget because I get to see what's the latest post from every of the blog that I follow and it just makes it really easy if I want to read it or not and I'll just skip it as well. Next is we have Carrot Weather. So Carrot Weather is probably one of the best weather apps on the iPhone and Carrot Weather has an amazing uh, list of widgets that you can choose from for your iPhone setup. So depending on what type of weather information you wanna see on your iPhone, Carrot Weather probably has a widget for you that will work out for your weather needs and weather information that you wanna see on your home screen. Moving on is we have Things 3. So Things 3, of course, is a powerful productivity tool for your iPhone. It's probably one of the best to-do apps right now on the iPhone that you can download. And they have a very powerful widgets as well. They have a medium, large, and um, small widget sizes that you can choose. And one of my favorite things about this widget is that it allows you to quickly add tasks right within the widget as well. So um, by before, before an update, um, you had to, of course, when you tap the widget, it will open the app and add it to, to your archive area. But now you can set up the widget to have it set up so that you can add a, a to-do or whatever you want directly to your new list that you currently have on the application as well. And also it makes it really easy to see all your to-dos right within the widget as well. Moving on is we have Apollo for Reddit. So Apollo for Reddit, of course, is probably one of the best Reddit clients out there for the iPhone. And they have a powerful widget, Apollo, as well. So you can, of course, uh, follow your favorite subreddits. You can see um, a quote of the day, photo of the day, um, whatever you want to see, you could get that right, when, right, from, uh, right within the widgets as well. And it's just there's a ton of widgets that you could choose from, from Apollo Reddit. That's probably going to find a widget for you that you'll really enjoy using. Next is we have affirmations. So affirmations, of course, will make your app, uh, your iPhone 13 home screen really, really aesthetically pleasing, but also give you that motivational boost that you need every single day to read. So affirmation, of course, will show you some great affirmations on a widget. So depending on the size, on small, medium, or large, you can see some really cool quotes of affirmations and you can actually customize it in the app as well what type of affirmations you want to see on your widget as well so those are some really great fantastic widgets that i just told you right now that you really need to go and check out if you really want to step up your home screen game on your new iphone uh, 13 that you just received for christmas and other than that, that's pretty much it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, it would be really cool if you guys would hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, because there's a ton of great videos that you have probably missed. And also, um, why not uh, subscribe to a tech channel this year and improve your tech, uh, your tech uh, uh, home screen setups on your iPhone 13. So that's it for now. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. And Merry Christmas.